here. And he and the Wolfpack are going to move the ball through the air. You figure quite a bit tonight on the ground on the very first play and a nice start. Quarterback, but his wide receivers as well. They have some great players on the outside. Finley throws for the first time, and there was good coverage. Just kind of threw it away. After the big kick return, great field position. Can they take advantage? Three-man rush. The throw is there incomplete. A catch, but out of bounds. Been in the red zone. C.J. Riley, the wide receiver, was the guy who recovered the fumble. This is Jacoby Myers, kind of a jet sweep style play, and there was nowhere to go. Maybe got a yard or game on third and ten. They can get a first down at about the two. Some pressure comes. Finley over the top, and it is incomplete. Knocked away. They were to win a football game. By the way, there was a very late penalty on that punt, so ten yards backwards for the Wolfpack. They get that right back. The first completion of the game to back to back because of a special teams turnover as the game got started. Now on the ground, a bigger hole and a better run. This is Ricky Person, the true freshman, still going. A little bit more what you guys were talking about, staying on schedule, handoff, and they're going to pitch it back. That was a great catch, He's actually by Myers, a former quarterback who whistles one toward coverage. It's incomplete. With him sort of picking his brain. It's third down and four. Finley in the pocket, throws, and that one is a little bit high off the hands, incomplete. Negative rushing yards total. Second and 15. Finley took a hit, but delivered the ball right on target for an NC State first down. Across. Throws that were not normal, Ryan Finley early. Maybe starting to get a little more comfortable. Downfield, and he's got a man. It's caught. That's Jacoby Myers. It didn't feel like he started out with his emotions in check. Play fake, and he's rolling out. Whistled one over there. That was a heck of a throw. Harmon inside the 10 down to the 8. Going to go all the way back to the 13. Lost five on that run. That's a short pass to Myers. Broke a tackle. Gets down to about the five. And the Wolfpack, second chance here inside the 10. They settled for three the first time. This time dropped. And they're probably going to have to settle and more. Well, at least you then have a decision to make. And you're right. You know, Myers is going to catch this ball right around the goal line. But the opportunity to fall forward. And ran over there to give you a hug during that ceremony. What does he mean to you? It means the world to me. He's just a guy that took a chance on a kid who was fresh off an injury in high school and just made a long way on his bye week to be here at his alma mater. Second down for Finley in the Wolfpack offense. And Finley, that one was dropped. Man, on both. Not playing very well so far. Have not converted to third down yet. Wolfpack Finley, a little hesitation now. Not necessarily the strength of his game. He tried to run for it, got across midfield. Brain wrist, and it can affect that snap. That one was a little bit low. He did snap it much quicker, the quick throw out to tackle. They found a home for him on the offensive line. He's going to play in the NFL. That went back to Harmon for a first down NC State. That's the first third down conversion for the Wolfpack in this first half. That's kind of amazing. They've had a lot of chances at it. Option style play. Finley will pitch very late to Myers along the side. Tim and Matt Hasselbeck. Laura Rutledge is with us. A handoff play with a Wake Forest defender in the backfield. Almost immediately a great run from Gillespie. He made a lot. Yesterday that they were watching film of Peyton Manning in 2014. I feel like they get an advantage in the run game from the pistol formation here for NC State. Prescott is back in the game. Finley, nice delivery to Harmon through traffic. He Harmon, one of the best receivers in the country, is having a nice first half. This time, Finley goes in the other direction, and the pass is complete to C.J. Riley. Plays one of the areas where Ryan Finley has really improved. In the pocket this time, with a lot of time, that one tipped up and incomplete. They six receivers in the ACC, and he's tried to recruit taller receivers ever since then. This one, same kind of spot, a lot of contact. Here comes the flag for the Demon Deacons. And Cameron Glenn is a solid player. He just, he gets there a little bit too early, and he didn't. Finley from that pistol formation swings it out left side. Harmon tries to get a block, and he will get stopped short. He can still beat him in basketball, but Ryan actually takes him on left-handed in ping pong and beats everybody with his left hand, not his dominant hand. And slowly move this ball down the field. He's going to take one here. And a turn to the outside, but a nice open field tackle. That will keep that clock. Opportunity to go undefeated at home, which is something you try to establish when you're trying to establish a winning program that wins consistently. You're right. They haven't done that in a long time. access, death by a thousand paper cuts, just taking what the defense gives you, not getting bored. If you see a double move, all of a sudden Wake gets aggressive. Harmon went out of bounds, but they because he got shoved, they, they kept the clock rolling. Now, and now he's playing down in the box. 
Third down at 12. Finley almost threw an interception into coverage. See, that was the idea. How do we fix this offense? The rushing game really has not been there. That went out to Harmon, who maybe was the bright spot for NC State. He is tough to get to the ground. Kelvin Harmon. Finley, a little bit of that pistol look. Pressure comes, picked up. Ryan Finley is complete. Up early in the game, they can pay off later in the game. Eli Drinkwitz, one of the best in the business. Another catch for Harmon. And a lot. Gillespie on the left side of Finley. Play clock under five, and the snap was not a great one. Ball still loose. Finley couldn't get to it. And <laughs> magically appeared the two uh, Eagle alums up here in the booth. Will be there in person. Ryan Finley going backwards and now will throw it away. Incomplete. It's second down. Let's go down to Laura. Rain has started to come down the hardest that it has all night. The football could be wet. Something to watch, too. Now that was a better snap, and it gave Finley a chance to cut behind the right guard because his snaps would always go to the right. I don't expect that from uh, Bradbury. Well, what a throw wow. and catch. Yeah. Myers on third down. No defense for the perfect throw. That was a perfect throw. It's great coverage. And sometimes you just got to tip your hat to the some of the leaders on this defense have had to step up and play and asked to do a little bit more than the normal guy. That completion short by plenty to hit here on third down when the offense is on the field. Finley will hand it off left side running and a big hole for a first down and more inside the 15 close to the 10. Funky unbalanced formation here. And they get it out on that unbalanced side. Myers with the catch trying to use those lead blockers who just Third and seven, Finley. That snap was not quite perfect. And I don't know if that interrupted the rhythm of that play or what. Also honesty, very honest about his quarterback. Second and 11 for Finley at NC State. Nice delivery across the middle. That's good for, you know, have that name recognition, but we like him. We like him a lot. Finley looked to me like he almost stumbled a couple different play fakes, and he drops one over the top. And there's an answer for NC State. Fake the around. And then a throw to one of these big wide receivers, and then a great adjustment by Myers. You know, look, look, we're talking about it. It's raining. That's an outstanding. Well done. So, third down, NC State, start of the fourth quarter. A competitive game and a nice pass. And a broken tackle out of the open. Amezi, touchdown, Wolfpack. And Finley, you know, in particular, but you know, they just decided to kind of just stick with it and you think about what they've done with. You know, kind of dealing sales substitution from second down to third down playing a lot of different players on defense because of the injury situation the catch and turn up field they are top time and avoiding sacks only been sacked one time in this game Finley that one is dropped that has been way too much uh, NC State's got a great quarterback tradition in recent years going back to Phillip Rivers Finley that time will throw a little bit high incomplete trying to find a hard Big, big play for the Wake Forest defense. They bring some pressure, but it was picked up. Down the sideline and a perfect delivery. The ball pops out, though. Down pass. Sure also, toot, by the way. Toot. I've thrown touchdown passes on just about every kind of throw you could make. A little short completion left side. Close to this. He's hardly practiced this season since fall camp. He got hurt at the end of fall camp. Finley to his favorite target. Harmon, another catch. That's his. First and 20 with the injured offensive lineman plus the penalty. That throw is right there on the money for a nice gain. And still going. Finally, Block continues to move. I mean, Wake Forest has their timeouts, but the time is not on their side. Harmon with the catch. That's a Wolfpack first down into a game. Uh, the, clock, the, the clock is winding down. And Wake needs a stop. Here comes a penalty flag in there. The pass was combined. Third and 14. And they are back to pass. Finley looking across the middle, throws across the middle, and the pass is caught. Now the stop was Wake Forest give their offense a chance. Finley looking right, throws right, and it is incomplete. Incomplete. And field position for this drive. No fair catch, and now that is doing you no good whatsoever. You just stunned, including us. And what a performance by Wake Forest. Finley will throw, and that one is caught. Nine slugs. Wake Forest in the super prevent defense now. Finley, clock winding, will throw to the sideline, and they do get out of bounds near midfield. Force back there as well. Should be the final play. Finley will step up and get everything he can into the ball and heave it toward the end zone. Here we go. Jump ball is intercepted. Intercepted Wake Forest.